All right, folks, it is time once again for another Latchkey Food Review. And today we're going back to Bojangles. They got two new items. It is April the 29th. They're about to get away from us. Uh, so at Bojangles, they got the uh, bird dogs. It's like a, looks like a chicken strip stuck in a hot dog bun to me, according to what I've seen from the sign. I could be wrong. I think that's what it is, how it's prepared up, and what fixings it has on it, other than the chicken strip stuffed inside the, the dog bun. I don't know. Uh, I do know this. Bojangles has some great chicken strips there they got the uh, the home style tenders which is their plan and then they got the Cajun style uh, I like them both but I'm a little more partial to the Cajun style chicken that Bojangles has to offer so I'm kind of looking forward to giving those good old tree out uh, you get two of them for five dollars I'm not exactly sure how many how many many different ways they prepare them I'm not sure also Bojangles has their new Bowberry cookies. From what I can tell, they are kind of made up like a chocolate chip cookie, except for instead of having chocolate chips, they got blueberry in there. So, uh, yeah, that sounds like a win to me cookie and blueberry i like both of those things so uh without further ado we're gonna go to bojangles and we're gonna try both of those out in the review coming up next all right folks i am now pulling into this here bojangles and uh just like me the bojangles brand has been around since the 70s <laughs> Uh, now I'm just going to tell you the absolute best thing they sell here is that them sweet potato pies but uh, we're not getting that today but I'm working when you're ready uh, yeah, let me get two of your bird dogs and two of your bowberry cookies. Do you want just the bird dogs or do you want them as a combo? Uh, let me get just the bird dogs. And then how many of your my bowberry cookies? The two bowberry cookies. All right, your total is four ninety five. Uh, seven ninety five. <laughs> all right, that sounds like it. <laughs> all right, thank you. I was about to get excited with that. Four ninety five price tag. I just saw something else I can do a review on. That'll be another day though. Uh, all right, folks. I'm gonna settle up with them, and we'll get back with you. We'll get these good old tree out. All right. Just like I said, this is a bird dog, and uh, it's just a chicken strip, and it's got Carolina Gold barbecue sauce on it. And a couple of pickles. Mm. It's a little hot out here today. I'm gonna have to crank up and get the air going. Look, I'm going to go ahead and tell you, you can create this bird dog situation yourself, all you need is some Carolina Gold barbecue sauce, uh, 
they sell it in the grocery store, any brand will do. Um, and go get you some hot dog buns and a whole bunch of Bojangles chicken strips and you can ha make your own bird dogs. Two of these for five dollars, a little pricey. I feel like I need about four of these for five dollars. I think that would be more of a more of a hit for me. They're good. I could have created that at home. I probably have created that in at home. Maybe not with Bojangles. <laughs> Feels sort of gimmicky to get you in here to me. Bird dog. Got a nice ring to it. I mean, it's okay. It's okay. Two for five dollars. Yeah, it's it's decent. Bojangles chicken is amazing though. They do a good job on their little chicken strips. put Bojangles against any chicken joint out there. Any of them. But as for, uh, look, Bojangles got some good chicken strips. Their chicken strips are two thumbs up all day long. As a bird dog, I feel like this is a, uh, it's got that old school snack type of feel. Like, uh, like you know, it should be a dollar item. <laughs> like they should offer that as a dollar item, you know. Or at least buy four for five bucks or something like that. You know, four of them for five dollars, I think, would be reasonable for a situation like that. So, for the price that they're charging, two for, uh, for because they make those chicken strips up anyway, right? They're already made up. Uh, they're just throwing one on a hot dog bun with a couple of pickles and some barbecue sauce. I mean, not a lot of effort went into that or a cost. 
for that matter. Uh, so for that reason, I'm going to have to give the bird dogs just a one and a half thumbs. Maybe even a one because I don't see myself purchasing those again. I see myself purchasing, you know, like a six. Six chicken strips, you know, for about six or seven bucks, you know, and going and making my own bird dogs at home or something. Now, this is what I'm most excited for. That is their bowberry cookie. Look at all them bowberries in there. And on the reverse side, we're going to bite right into that part right there where all those blueberries are ganged up in there together. Oh, yeah. That right there is good. I don't care who you are. Man. That is just like eating chocolate chip with blueberries in it. That's freaking amazing. Oh yeah, I'm enjoying that. That is good. Now those were $2.27. Now give me two of them. And they had decent sized cookie. Those are a big old two thumbs up. Big two thumbs up on the uh, Bowberry cookies. All right, folks. That is all I have for this review. So until the next one, you folks have a good one.